today I feel a ton better. I still, eh, I'm about like 75%, I think. Um, but uh, the last two days just totally kicked my butt and I was so tired and so hungry. And it is just about two o'clock and all I've had today is coffee. I'm not hungry whatsoever. So it'll be interesting to see what dinner is gonna be like tonight. Um, it's just gonna be Lauren and I for dinner tonight. Um, so me and my daughter and uh, my husband is actually picking up our son um, from school uh, to go to the Seahawk game tonight. So they're gonna go and have fun, see grandma and papa, eat all the stuff. He always gets so spoiled when he goes. Um, but that's fun. You know, it's he goes a couple times a year and they have a good time. So um, he's going to pick up Sawyer. I'm going to pick up Lauren. And Lauren and I are going to come back here and just hang out. Um, I, like I said, I do feel a lot better. Um, but I am just not hungry. So um, I don't know. Maybe I will be in a couple hours when we typically have dinner. And we'll see how it goes. So other than that, um, we're having a good day. I got a lot of editing done. Got some videos coming up. And um, yeah. So we'll just see how the rest of the night goes and see what we do for dinner. All right. See you later. Alright, so this is my dinner. This is the kale and chicken burger from Costco. Yeah. And then we had some green peppers and red peppers left over from an omelet I made the other day and some green beans. And then I put some garlic salt and uh, some pepper on top. And that's what I'm having, as well as a smoothie. Lauren and I are sharing it. And that is our dinner. Lauren and I will be making the Keto Connect chocolate fudge cookies. Okay, so should we talk about what we're using? Sugar. And then we did a half a cup of the unsweetened cocoa powder. 
and then we did a quarter cup of butter. Melted butter. Melted butter. Just 30 yeah. seconds in the microwave. Look, look, look. Look, look. And combine. All right. Okay, put your hand on it too. We do it together.
<laughs> because because of the almond flour and stuff, they don't rise a whole bunch. So, okay, so we're gonna make them kind of thick so that they're nice and fudge-like. There you go, kind of like that. All right, so let's take a look here. So you can kind of see they're pretty thick. All right. <laughs> All right, they're not going to spread out a whole lot, so we're going to make them kind of thick so they're nice and fudgy. Um, they're on preheated for about 350 right now, and I would say maybe about 12 or 14 minutes. And the recipe that I'm doing is the Keto Connect chocolate fudge cookies. I think they posted it back in like 2017, I think is the recipe that I saw. So I believe it's about two carbs per cookie. So just kind of shape them, make them, you know, whatever you want. So this is what they look like. And they're pretty thick. So I was able to get, I could have probably got maybe 10 of them in there, but I made a couple of them like this one, kind of big. So um, yeah, so I'll go ahead and put them in, um, in the oven on 350 for about, I'll probably do about 10 minutes, but it'll probably take about 12 to 15. I'll just keep an eye on them. <laughs> All right, so this is after, what are we at, 14 minutes? I think they might be good. All right, so this is nine of them. A couple of them are a little bit big. The recipe I actually went back to, and it did say 10. So these are going to be over, a little over two grams net carbs. Uh, because I only made nine instead of ten so and if you made ten it would have been two grams so um, this is gonna be a little over that and uh, but otherwise they're looking really good so we'll just see how they taste and I'll let my little taste tester test them in a few minutes after they cool down will you grab a big one okay stay right there Nice, it yummy. Thanks for your help, helper. You're All right, so you heard it. They must be pretty good. So let's try it. Mmm. They look like a brownie. Yeah. That's what it looks like. So we made them a little bit thicker so that when we cooked them, the middle didn't get as done. So it's more brownie-like. So it's more fudge-like. They're nice and squishy, but they're good. Yummy, yummy. All right. So did you have fun making them? Would you make them again? Are they really good? Yeah. Would you make them again? Yeah. yeah. Cool. This well, is my second one. Yes. No. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching, and Subscribe. what are we going to do now? Subscribe, like, comment, do all the things, hit the notification. If you want. If you want to. If you like what we're doing here, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, join, do all the things. I do post on Instagram as well at Keto for Everybody. And we'd love to have you over there as well. My silly pants here. <laughs> um, but we're going to go ahead and watch the rest of the Seahawks game. Okay. Daddy and brother are at the game, mm -hmm. they're having fun. I'm so enjoying my cookies. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, we will see you in the next video. Bye.